All right, guys, what is going on? We are about 80 kilometers offshore at the moment. It's an absolute magic day. I went on the camera, he's been so kind enough to film for me today, but he will be fishing as well. Um, like I said, we're 80 k's offshore. We're sitting on a wreck. Never fished this wreck before, but um, a mate of ours fished it yesterday and he got absolutely tailed up all day. So we're gonna do a little bit of jigging in the beginning and then we're gonna go hit the flats like usual with the swims and try and get some trout and stuff. But I wouldn't mind getting stretched off this wreck first, try and pull a red on some jigs. So the first plan is send some jigs down, do a little bit of slow jigging and um, we'll see how we go. I think I'm on a fish. It's a lot of line to go out. Oh my god, I got hit on the way up! Oh, yes, boy. Oh. Oh, oh shit, man! Oh my god! Oh, I can't even turn this thing's head, man! Uh, uh. We're using the wrong rods for this. Oh god, he wants down. Uh, oh god, he wants down. Uh, 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 uh. This thing is huge, man. Whatever it is, I don't even think I can turn its head, man. Uh, 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 uh. Oh god, this thing's big. Uh. Uh, 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 uh. Oh sh I can't even turn this thing's head man. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, that's a big fish. Uh, uh. Can you um is there a gimbal? That rod yeah. bucket in there? Can you pass it here please? It would be in one of the probably not the yeah, probably the front two. If I've packed it. Yeah, I know it was on the before we left, so. It'd be in one of the front two, man, right up the front. Uh, yeah. Uh, 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 I gotta get the Oh. Thanks, man. Yeah. Oh. Otherwise, Robin will kill me and I won't be able to have any kids. Oh. Oh. That's right. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh. Oh. Holy moly, this thing's big. Whatever it is. Go back down now. Oh my god. Oh. Please take it back down. Please don't do this. Oh. 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 Holy crap. I, I can't turn this head, man. It's, it's too big. Uh, uh, uh. I don't think it's a shark because it doesn't have those big head shakes. Good ground. I'm not making any ground on it. I don't think you are. I can't turn this thing's head, man. Holy moly. Oh. There we go. That's one wind. What do you mean, there we go? That's true. Uh, 
dead set, you're gonna blow my back out. Holy crap. We might have to rotate this fish, man. Holy crap. I don't know about that. I don't, I don't want to be responsible for that. Oh, I don't care if we lose it. It's probably some giant bloody cod or something. Yeah, you make the camera. That's it. That's it. No, once you go back down now. I can't even see colour yet. Oh my god. Please don't go back down. Please don't do this. Holy crap. I need to go around the throat. Right, good boy. Nice. Holy shit. You must, you must be getting closer. <sighs> My back is like on fire. Oh. oh, my back. Holy crap. It's coming up. Can you see him? Not yet. <laughs> but depending on what colour he is, that might not be easy either way. But oh man, if he's running fast around the boat and taking you with him, he's got to be fast. Are you doing something? I can oh, see colour. Oh no. Is it a shark? No, I don't think it's a shark. No, I think it's a shark. Oh, it's a huge trevally. It's a huge giant trevally, man. Oh my god. It's the biggest trevally I've ever caught in my life. Uh. Oh my Boy. god, man. He's coming. Dude, it's a 40 kilo fish. Okay, you need to, um, I'm gonna have to sing in the boat. Yep. Here he comes, look at it. Whoa. Oh my god. Huge, gorgeous fish. Dude. Look at the size of that GT! Oh, oh my god! That's that's gonna be 35, 40 kilos, man. Holy crap! Alright. Ready? Oh my oh my god! Don't lose it. Okay. You gotta grab both hands on that tail, eh? And tie. Okay, okay, hang on. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, just hold him. Yep. Hold on for a second. Okay, hang on. Ready? Okay, go. Oh, you giant. He's a giant. Dude, that's <laughs> that's a giant. Oh my god. Yeah! <laughs> that's a giant! How big is that fish? We're gonna weigh him, mate. I've got scales and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wanna weigh him. Let's be quick. Yeah. Oh my god, it's so big. It is so big, man. It is huge! Holy shh! On the little... Dude, I got this fish on that tiny little JML chick. Oh my god. Holy crap, alright, we're gonna... That is crazy, alright, we're gonna weigh this fish because I think this is probably over 30, close to 40 kilos. Owen's just gonna hold him so he stops moving. Look at the girth on this thing. Look at the freaking girth on that fish. Alright. Just film me for a second. Alright, I bought scales and everything to weigh these kinds of fish. So, and this is why, and a proper good weigh sling. So, this is what I got all this for. I think it's 
too big for the sleep. There we go, he's in. There we go. Alright, he's in. Cut this out. This. How heavy do you reckon? Yeah. 30... 31 kegs. You going 31? Yeah. Alright, I'm going 35. Alright, ready? Ready. Oh, no, it's not. Why is it not? Come on. Come on. There we go. Alright, ready? Yep. Oh, 30 kilos. It's moving a bit, but... There we go. He'd be like a 29, 30 kilo fish. Right. Oh. Nice. All right, quick photos, and then he's out of here. There you have it, guys. 29 to 30 kilos of pure GT muscle on the tiny JML jig. This fish really made me work for it, but best part now is we get to let him go, so I'm going to see if I can pop the jig out like this. Can you pop it out with those pies, man? Just there. Go down, no, no, right to the point of the hook. Yep. Now flick it back. Hard. There you go. Drop. All right, here he is. This giant is going back home. See you, mate. Oh, straight away. Oh. Let's never do that again. That was an absolute horse, my biggest GT ever. 30 kilos on the scale, digi scale, you guys saw it. It was rotating between 28 and 30, but it's because of the, the movement and stuff and it couldn't very well set on an exact scale, but 30 kegs on the dot and on a tiny little JML jig right there. It's true, elephants do eat peanuts. That thing was a giant. It's now Owen's turn to get his back broken because I'm not going back down. Yeah. Sorry guys, I thought I was recording. Owen is on a giant. Probably another big G. Can you even move it? Has it got you in the bottom? No, no, no. Are you sure? Pretty sure. I think that might be bottom, man. I think it got you. I think it's bricked you. No. Maybe. No, I don't think it has. Because it's not moving relative to us. One, did one down. All right, ready? Try and lift. Yeah. Just be careful on the rod. Yeah. Yep, you got him. It's not the bottom. So try and have straight arm. Yeah, bend that arm and then just work through your back and your legs. You can't even lift this fucking fish, man. <laughs> Owen really wanted a big dog. I think he's got it. Yeah. Just, okay, you need to walk around. Walk around the boat. Come around, keep it away from the motor. Walk, 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 walk. Keep it in front, over the motor, over the motor. There you go. Okay, oh, yeah. that's oh. a fish. Why was my deadlift yesterday? Well, you shouldn't have. I thought I was... You got a big G on, man. Hang on. Sure yeah, you're good. Can you even turn this thing's head? Oh god. You can't yeah, hang on, you can't wind, yeah. Okay, you need to go around again, follow it around. There you go. I think you may have had like I think you got you had a fish and somebody's eaten it. Because this thing is a giant of a fish. Careful side of the boat. Walk up. You are right? <laughs> and you got to realise, this thing's still on the bottom, Owen. It's not. It's 10 foot from the boat. It's t I'll tell you right now, it's not. It is. If I think it's on the bottom, I'll give up. Oh, no, no. 
<laughs> no. <laughs> Can I have some <laughs> oh. All right, all right, all right, all right. So I caught the GT and then Owen complained. He goes, all I want to do is catch a sports fish. He's like, you catch a sports fish, I always seem to catch the GTs. And I was like, oh no, sorry. Owen's like, he always catches the, the, the Spanish or whatever. And I always seem to catch a sport fish like the GT or whatever. Owen's finally got his G and he's hating every minute of it. I want a smaller one. Ah, ah. Oh, God. <laughs> Thumbnail material. How's your back? Hurts. I had to fight mine to the boat, you gotta do the same. It probably is a big G-man, like the same thing that happened with me. Remember how it just dogged for a while? So just try, right? Don't try and get 50 ones in one hit, just go down one. One, and just keep trying to bring it up like that. But this is why we need shorter jigging rods, for this exact reason. Oh, come on. No, you're gonna have to, you're gonna have to start bringing it up. Oh. There you go. So while Owen's struggling right there, I just want you guys to realize that I wanted help on my fish too, and Owen said, no, I've got it. So there's gonna help. be- I really need help. There's gonna be zero help. No. Really help. But Owen, you got the spin. Okay, new, new plan, right? Sit down, put your legs up on here, put your feet up on here, sit. There you go. There you go. Just don't try and over hype and extend that rod and you'll be right. right I'm going to have to um, turn the electric off and pull it out of the water so we can drift a little bit. And it doesn't have to... There you go. Is that a bit better? All right, about five or 10 minutes later, we have color. And I think I want how to fish, but it's probably like a 150, 200 kilo bloody shark coming up now. Yeah, it's a shark. Damn. Huh? Put him in the sling. <laughs> Try and control him back that way. Yeah, you're turning his head. Bring him around. Watch that. Go forward. Go over. Oh, oh, oh. Yep, sweet. There you good. There you go. Yeah, it's a huge shark, man. So close. He'd be like 10 meters under the boat. Higher up. Better, better range of mine. I can't. My back's blown. <laughs> you thought it was a baby great white? No. no, 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 no. It's probably a bronze whaler. I think it's a grey reefy. Is he a leader? Oh my god, you're big. Oh my god, that is... The... Oh, you hooked him in the... Where is he hooked? Does he, have the, he has my other jig in his... Oh my god! No. Oh. Oh. And just like that, it was all over. Heap of fish underneath us now. Oh. Oh no, is that no? It's my water back in some time. Oh, I just got snipped. Mackerel. I can see him underneath us. Yeah, 
Yep. Bloody mackerel. Oh, snippity snap straight through 130 pound leader like it was nothing. Wouldn't mind a mackerel. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm good. Like, oh god, there's so many mackerel underneath us now. Yeah, I, I've sort of have the um, the technique sort of down packed. You down? There you go. That's it. There you go. Remember, I worked it almost all the way to the boat, so. Yeah. You go, if you want to go a little bit more for, further forward all the way. Just work it all the way to the boat every time, pretty much. Yep, there we go. There we go. All right. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. That's a Mackie. Nice, I'm coming. Do you want a gimbal or are you good? No, I'm okay. No, gimbal, please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I oh. Oh. What's wrong? Swim in towards you, you're right, you got it. Just let it go if it wants to go. Okay, I'm gonna put my gloves on. Yeah. Oh. Nice. It's in it, it's in the boat. Look at the look at the size of it, it's a nice one. Can I listen to the drag just a touch? Smack it, let it run if it wants to. Oh, is it a it's a long tail tuna, man. Is it? No, it's a Spanish. It's a nice Spanish. It's a good keeper size. Walk up the front, walk around. Walk around the boat. Don't give any slack. Oh, there's a, there's a shark underneath you. No, okay. You got him. He's right. He's right. He's right. He's right. He's right. I got him. Got him? Yep, I got him. Okay, just watch out. Because these guys, look at the shark underneath you. Where is it? Where's the shark? Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, it's an, it could be a shark or another yeah, mackerel. No, I think it's another mackerel. It's a shark, it's a small shark. All right. Tasty. This guy will try and bite you. Let's eat. We had a massive schooler. Mackie's come through. And I will manage to get a nice Spanish. Perfect eating size. How heavy you reckon? Three or four? Yeah, maybe five. Oh, nice fish. Five. Nice fish, man. All right, he will be coming home for dinner with us. I'm gonna get a photo of it. We're gonna bleed it, I won't show you that, and then we're gonna put him straight on ice. All right, guys, you join me back at the house. Thank you so much for watching that video. It was a very, very, very fun, productive day. I absolutely loved it. Um, fishing was a little bit tough. We tried to hit the flats, but unfortunately, with the tide being so small and the westerlies blowing through, um, fishing the flats was tough. We got a couple of fish, but I just didn't really include it in the video. Now, before you guys jump on my back, yes, I know we used the wrong rods. We should have been using jigging rods. Um, we used stick baiting popping rods instead. Why? I don't know. We'll ever do it again. Definitely not. That GT almost killed me. Um, I don't know if you could really see it on film, but. The scale was sort of moving between, once the um, boat had settled a little bit, the scale was moving between 29 to 30 kilos on that GT, so an absolute stomp, but it come up from the depths and on a small little JML jig, so elephants really do eat peanuts. Oh, and got that huge shark, which was just unbelievable. It, it was really, really awesome to watch, and he fought it really, really well, and then that mackerel. Um, we got a couple of coral trout on the flats, um, and I got busted by a couple of spanglers, but I didn't include that in the video, um, just because I thought there was just enough awesome action in that video. Um, anyway, guys, I'm so glad you loved the video. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, please subscribe, do all that good stuff, and I will see you in the next video.